we were living in Knoxville, and my wife and I were down by the riverfront. And when we were leaving, we noticed uh, people living under a bridge, uh, had cardboard boxes for furniture, and an old couch looked like it had been taken out of a dumpster. And we talked about it on the way home because it was the weather was getting cold in Knoxville at that time. And uh, that night we had trouble sleeping. So the next morning we went down to Kmart and bought six nice warm blankets and carried down to it. And the people were gone. We asked the people uh, around there what happened to them. And they said the police made them leave. So we carried the blankets down to the homeless shelter and donated them. But that started what later became Silent Angels nonprofit. And we distributed blankets, uh, food, clothes, whatever people needed from coast to coast in the United States. And we assisted in five foreign countries. I think what I would like people to understand is that all God expects us to do is just what we can. He doesn't expect us to do any more than what we're able to do. And if we do that, uh, I think that, that's all He expects. It's like the, the, the parable of the talents. The ones that use what they had, God gave them more. And I like to think of opportunities. If we use the opportunities that God gives us to help people, He's going to give us more.